Okay. How's the audio on this? Um, I know it's, maybe it's a bit loud right now. Let the... Maybe we'll... Did you ever play Super Paper Mario? Yeah, I've played it. I've played it a couple of times? I don't know how many times I beat it. Like two or three times. Okay. Welcome to Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. So we're like very, very end game. I could go to the, uh, I could go through the door that's old. But instead, I am not going to, I'm going to do the pit. Uh, I may not say it often, but I really appreciate your streams, Poppy. You do games right. We're going to get our game faces on today. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Anything but help go, go help Peach. Yeah, I know that she's kind of in dire need um, because, you know, something, something about something about d demons or something, something. Um, but maybe first I just do a little challenge. All right, so let's see. So what do we have for our items here? So we're going to want life mushroom, jelly, Ul jelly ultra, couples cake, choco cake, ultra mushroom. Makes you invisible, electrified, or sleepy. Koopa bun, couples cake again, another life shroom, maple syrups. What the fuck? Coconut bomb. Something, something, not having grunnel time. Ah, she'll be fine. She'll be fine. She's always fine. Okay, let's see. What do I have here? Is this cookie is good? Choco candy could be good. Um, what else could I store? I feel like 10 FP isn't bad. I feel like I don't want the love pudding. Um. I think this could be fine. Having two extra spaces for things that, uh, the, the, for stuff that might drop later too. That seems good. Oops. I didn't mean to hit the, hit the thing. I think it's rough reviews, but it's a really fun game in the series. Super Paper Mario? Super Paper Mario is decent. Um, you know, I don't think the gameplay is very engaging. Uh, you know, I think... I think um, this story is good, though, and the lore is good. But I don't really know why they decided to take away the combat and stuff. This shop guy in the video. Hello, super Olivia. You're also a billionaire. Yeah, I have a lot of money. I have a lot of money, maybe. Okay, let's see. So what do I have on? Power bounce, piercing blow, ice smash, fire drive, quake hammer, double dip. Hmm. Lucky start, happy heart, happy flower, pity flower. So having like flower finder would be good. Um, I can definitely like take off one of these. I mean, pity flower is good too, but I feel like I remember in the other times, um, I never used power bounce. We'll do that and we'll put on flower finder. I'm going to have to like, oh, I'm going to sell head rattle. I have two of those. Okay. I also have two HP plus. Who knows? Maybe I'll decide to use them though. We can keep those. Mm. Yeah, I think that's fine. Fuck. I think uh, Super Mario is a great start. If it the gameplay the first two would be peak, it'd be really good. 
And then also if it had party members properly. All right, did I put it? Okay, no, I didn't. But yeah, flower finder will be handy in the in the pit, I think. Um, cause er my early strat will be using um flurry to kind of try to blow enemies away, quite literally. So, um. All right, we good for health and everything too. Mm, RFP is a little low. Let's sleep at the inn. Pixels were neat, but yeah. Yeah, I wish there was more, like, personality to the pixels, though. Because they just, like, kind of come up and talk to you. And the only one that has any is, um... Wait, why am I talking to Luigi? The only one that has any personality is, uh... Why do I want to call her Tattle? I don't think that was her name. Was it? Tippy. That's it. Tippy. Yeah, Tippy has lore. But the rest of them are just like, hello, I'm the pixel that happens to be a hammer. So excited to join you. And then that's it. Yeah, after super, super went, it went sticker star, color splash. Origami King, right? Oh, let's check to see if I won the lottery. Who knows? Maybe I won the lottery. I didn't win the lottery. You did it? How happy? You won the fourth prize? Wait, why did I win the fourth prize? What? Oh, <laughs> what? Okay. Thank you. One of the digits matched? Oh, fuck yeah. Woo! I feel like one time it matched, but that didn't happen. Maybe, maybe I misread my number or something. Origami King's not bad. It's not a bad game. Um, it's funny. It looks good. It's a game. Is it as good as Paper Mario Thousand Year Door or Paper Mario 64? No, not by a long shot. But it has, it has its moments. Okay. There's like a quick way to get to... The pit from here, I think, but I think I might have went the wrong way already. It was filled up room. It's so beautiful. Oh, it's this. I think. Oh, it's not. I went the wrong way. There was probably a pipe on the other side I could have gone down, but that's fine. I'll just go in this direction. I was thinking of that pixel because you can um, make him say a phrase of your choice when meeting him. Oh yeah, there was one like that. Yeah, it's been a long time. It's a long time since I played Super. Thousand your door, here we come. Just kidding. We're not going in there. We're gonna we're gonna attempt the pit. Um, I don't know if you're supposed- I think you're, like, legit supposed to attempt the pit after you beat the game, but... We'll see what happens. Um, okay. So I've already tattled on a lot of enemies in here, so... We can just... I have chill out and I have first strike on. I don't think that works here, though. Because there's the badge that makes it so that... If you hit like a smaller enemy in the map, it will go away. Never succumb to a first strike. Enables you to defeat weak foes with your first strike on the field. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I think he counts as a weak foe, but I don't think it works like that. All right, flurry. Yeah, I still have Lucky Start on. I don't know if I need that, but... Actually, you know what? It's not worth trying to blow them away. At this stage. Because I can, I can just do this. It'll be over. Because there's only two enemies here. So never mind that. Yeah. 
game. Yeah, Gale's, yeah, Gale would be better to use when there's more than two enemies. Two weak enemies. It was rough when done before TTYD Dungeon, but you've also done some pretty high levels in the pit before, so it might make up for it some, to some degree. Yeah, I'm hoping. We'll see. What the fuck? Oh yeah, I have the Bowser badge on. I think Quake Hammer only does two damage. Do I just try it maybe? I don't know, I'm just gonna try it. Okay. I'm gonna rearrange my badges. I've already realized I've some badges that would be helpful. Okay, I wasted a little bit of FP. But that's okay. Oh, Vampy! How's it going? Um... Okay, so we have Piercing Blow, Ice Smash, Fire Drive. Okay. Double Dip. Blah, blah, blah. We have Damage Dodge P. I'm just gonna take off some of these. Happy Heart, Happy Flower. Lucky Start. Um, we don't need Lucky Start early levels. Happy Heart and Happy Flower won't be bad to have early levels, so I'm gonna leave that. Quick change. Allow your partner to act after swapping partner. I think that might be helpful just like now. Never succumb to a first strike. <laughs> okay, pity flower, happy heart, happy heart pee, happy flower. Okay. So... Increase your jump attack by one, but lose your hammer ability. Increase your hammer attack by one, but lose your jump ability. Mm. Okay, so we still have five BP. Super tired, but excited. Oh! Excited for anything in particular? Mm. Decrease the FP Mario uses by one. Or your partner's used by one. That could be good for flurry. Drop Mario's attack bar one, but repay. Uh, no. Mm. Okay, okay, hold on. I'm trying to think. What's a good idea here? Maybe flower saver P. And then we have one. So. I'll, um, put Chill Out back on. Okay. This this might help, but yeah, this way, if I enter a fight with Flurry and I realize, oh, Coops would be help helpful here, I can just swap Coops in. No problems. Okay, see, I'm not succumbing to a first strike. Oh, money. Yay! Okay, um, so there's only two, however, he has spikes. Yay, okay. So, instead of doing Gale, we'll just... Let me take later. Just feel today is gonna be a good day for me. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, the partner change badge is nice. It's just expensive. And seven FP. So I mean, or BP. So it's kind of a lot. But I mean, by the time I'm kind of near the end here, I'll probably increase some of my BP. 
Also, um, by the way, I, I'm not moving apartments this summer. So I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna, uh, redecorate this room. So I've wa been wanting to get rid of this bed because I don't use it anymore. But... How much health do these guys have? Instead of, um... Getting rid of the bed completely, because Chili, like, uh... He... He likes the bed a lot. He sleeps in here all the time. But I'm thinking of getting a twin bed. <laughs> my cat's so spoiled. He just gets a whole ass twin bed. I take that. Yeah, it's a good thing. It's not because there's no options or anything. Um, Leon was offered a like a, a cost of living raise. So we're, it's just like a little tight timing with Japan to try to move at the same time. So this actually bought us a little bit more time. So we'll probably still move this year, but I, yeah, I kind of want to redecorate this room a little bit. Because that's the one thing I was looking forward to when it came to um, moving. I was like looking forward to having a different kind of background, but I can still make that happen at some point. It'd be really cool to see what you do with it. Thank you. I kind of want to do like, I kind of want to decorate this room like um, like a 2000s bedroom, sort of inspired by it. You know, and then I can have like my stuff in the, the back, like all my games and stuff displayed and it would look really good. What am I doing? But to recreate her childhood bedroom, you guys wouldn't like that. My childhood bedroom looked creepy. I had a day bed, but it was very floral and I had a collection of antique glass dolls that I inherited from my grandma. And those were on shelves. And I had like a really large oak <laughs> uh, dresser. And then I just slapped a fucking VHS TV on that bad boy. So yeah, it was weird. It looked, it looked old. Cause it was. Can you please put the messed up radio someplace? <laughs> Absolutely do that. Oh my God. I do have um I do have like an uh, like ash shelf that has some stuff on it, um and then I don't know I have some other I have some thoughts, so it sh I feel like my my ideas should be hopefully pretty inexpensive. At least one doll, yeah I don't know what my mom did with those glass dolls but hopefully they went to a collector. What's more retro than creepy dolls? Man it's so funny because I wasn't allowed to watch horror media or anything when I was a kid. So, so often I had uh, friends come over and they would like see the glass dolls. They were like facing my bed too. And they'd be like, doesn't that bother you? And I'd be like, what, the dolls? No, like why would that bother me, the dolls? But yeah, my friends, uh, they did not like that. <laughs> they were super creeped out by the glass dolls. Yeah, they, they definitely had seen Chucky, I think. How do you revoke my statement about having a good day? Wait, did that ruin your day? Yeah, actually there was a there was even um like an old clown like picture that was in my room that I made my mom take down though. Um it was like a clown girl doing her makeup and I hated it. I told my mom I was like, it's haunted. It's haunted. Did you start placing them in your friend's room as his pranks? No, I didn't. But one time I had like a, like a slumber party. So I had like, I don't know. Um, how many were there? Six, six girls sleep over. Mostly they consisted of my neighbors, but you know, we did the thing where we um, told scary stories 
And my mom had this, uh, she still has it actually, but it's like a foam skull. It looks really cool, but it was like a Halloween decoration she bought that she just kept up like all year. And, um, you know, my friends, like they would always comment on it when they saw it. But like, after we told the scary stories, I brought the foam skull into the room. And they freaked out. They freaked out, like kicked it. It was fine. It was not damaged, but it was pretty funny. What about my makeup? It, what, what, wait, what about it? <laughs> you got Sharpie all over your face? Oh, day ruined. Are you familiar with a lot of the Catholic descriptions of Jesus? Not familiar even in the slightest. I've seen like the depictions of Jesus, like the pictures. Um, but yeah, I'm like really, really unfamiliar with like regular Bible stuff. Like very, very unfamiliar with it. Bye Joseph, take care. There was a period my sister was little where she was scared of some Jesus portraits because they like to depict him with a cross and blood and stuff. Oh, that depiction. Okay. That's a depiction that I, that I understand. I've seen that. But yeah, that's valid. It is a little morbid. I did go over to my friend, my friend's house when I was in like sixth grade and her family was pretty religious. They were like, Catholic? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know which one they were. Probably Catholic? I don't know. I don't exactly know how to, like, tell the difference off of observation. Um. Yeah, that's in- why did I do that, even? I should just use Gale. Oh, never mind. Um. But I did notice that they had, like, a cross above their door. Like, in her bedroom. So, like, I slept in her bedroom. And, yeah, above the door, like, facing the bed, was, like, Jesus on the cross. And I was like, that's a bit creepy. <laughs> Dying Jesus watching over you while you sleep. It feels a little morbid, but okay. Mormon Jesus is best Jesus. Does Mormon Jesus not, not do that? Yeah, that's super co common in Catholicism. Catholicism? Not sure if I pronounced that correctly. How much health do these guys have? Okay, yeah, I can get them with quick hammer. It couldn't either. My family is raised Catholic, is all, but it's more common than Christianity in Latin America. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Mormon Jesus is very white and happy and co uh, like comically so. They have pictures in their houses so like, like in their house, like some kind of North Korea king of happy, happy, happy Jesus. Oh, interesting. Let's see this picture. Oh yeah. Wow. <laughs> that screams Mormon, even though I'm not familiar. It looks like a graduation picture. Yeah. Isn't, wasn't, wasn't Jesus from like Egypt? Fuck. Yeah, he's like Middle Eastern, no shit. <laughs> just got blonde hair, blue eyes. <laughs> that was close. Well, until he magic spelled his ass to America from the Mormons, right? In the hat? Hi, Viking. All right, see that FP, uh, that FP finder is uh, coming through. Like we've lost like no FP. <laughs> oh shit. 
Hey, what's up? I'm Mover. I know a few things about getting through this dungeon. For a few coins, I can move you where you want to go, where you want to go. Let's go down five levels! Yes! Give me ahead of it, buddy! Nice. The Garden of Eden was in America? They really believe that? <laughs> awesome. Jackson County? Wow. <laughs> That's great. Games are so conceited. <laughs> yep. The world? I remember my mom telling me about how the Garden of Eden had moved locations. That's funny. That's really funny. Hooray! Okay, wait, what level are we on? <sighs> level 20. Okay, we're getting there. Apparently there's a specific part of Japan that people claim Jesus went to after resurrecting. That's where he lived until 100 plus. Wait. What? <laughs> oh. I mean, personally, if I were gonna resurrect and live to a hundred plus, I guess I'd probably do it in Japan. So... Makes sense. <laughs> Jesus is the first weeb confirmed. <laughs> huh. That kind of sounds- that, I don't know. That kind of reminds me of like... The conspiracy theories about uh, celebrities. Um, faking their death and then just moving to like Celebrity Island. <laughs> Jesus, just watching Death Note and commenting on anime, anime forums. <laughs> oh shit, she can't body. Oh wait. Don't fucking throw rocks at me. Okay, yeah, this is nice. Oh no! Okay, that still did it. Yeah. I don't know, is it? That theory that like, the celebrity, like there's like the theory that like Elvis and Marilyn Monroe didn't actually die and they like live on an uh, island and, or they lived uh, on an island? Cause I guess they'd be super old now. But like people claim to have like work at a resort and have seen it. Is that where that conspiracy theory? Because it's like, I don't know. It's kind of confusing. Because why would you just move? Why would you? I, would it work even? I guess to like just go to a fucking resort somewhere. I don't know. Apparently, there's a little bit of evidence that some Arabic words made their way into the that section of Japan. So it's possible there's something. Two something, but yeah, I can't say. Sounds feasible that Jesus Christ himself went there. Ah. You know, <laughs> I don't even know. I, I don't know like a lot about about this stuff, so I'm just like, okay, <laughs> they're, they're having fun. <laughs> a coworker keeps calling me Jesus. Is it because you have like long hair and a beard or is it unrelated? Yes, ah, uh, yeah, yeah. The classic. In the Project Band video, if uh, you wanted to see it, it's so fucking funny. Oh, yeah, if you want to send it to me. 
I'm going to Japan soon. Like, too soon. Too soon. All right, let's try this. Or should I send it? Uh, Discord? Dealer's choice? Yeah, I'm going to Japan uh, in like a month-ish. So I'm nervous. I hope I hope I will be fully prepared. It's gonna be such a great time. I'm excited for you. Thank you. My sister's in Japan right now. She went to this Snoopy restaurant today. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I don't know. I don't have like a big like crazy itinerary for stuff that I'm gonna do. I know some people like to do their trips where they plan out like every hour and like every activity. Um, every time I go somewhere, I just kind of go with the vibe. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna have like stuff on in my list of stuff that I want to do eventually, but I'll probably just do stuff. I think I'm gonna aim to go to Japan in like 2025 or 26. That's valid. You'll see so many cool things still. That's really the best way to do it, I think. Yeah, some people, like, I find myself to be more stressed if everything is planned. Some people find themselves to be more stressed if everything is not planned, but yeah. Make sure you get your su Suka card and stuff for transfer for you go. Suka card. Are you talking about the train pass? My friend group really wants to do a uh, Japan trip. Hell yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. I was talking to some people who went to Japan recently. They said the train thing uh, isn't worth it anymore. Because I did some research and I talked to them about it. And they were like, oh yeah, that. Like, it's only worth it if you're going to be on the train, like, multiple times a day. So... Yeah. I was looking into it a little bit, but the price is upping and all the, the places that like also accept it are going down. Something like that. What? No way. This guy again? Holy shit. Down five levels. Let's go. But yeah, it's it's definitely something I've considered a little bit, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm excited though. It's going to be fun. But yeah, I just, I think I need to buy a few different things. Actually, why would I need to buy stuff? I'm going to be there. So why would I buy? So I was thinking like, oh, I need a skirt, like a summertime skirt. But what if I bought a summertime skirt while I was there? Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, 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 Let's see if this works. Are you a kimono? Got it. Who else wants something? Okay, just that guy is awake still. Get out of town! Yeah. Be more fun to buy one there, and then you have something to wear. Yeah, exactly. I just, I, I just thought of that because like, there's definitely places that you can go to that have like good clothes, and they're, they're also like cheaper there. And I'm planning on buying another suitcase on there, so I'm like, yeah, wait, what am I doing? What am I thinking? Oh, am I going to Vietnam in the fall? That's exciting. Vietnam does seem really beautiful. Yeah. Um, okay. There's only two enemies, so... I 
Okay, hopefully this is good. Because these fuzzies are really fucking annoying. Okay, good. Apparently it's not to buy socks at convenience stores there, so if you're lacking in socks, I actually just got a whole bunch of socks. My favorite thing when I go on trips is just find cool rocks on the floor. I like cool rocks too. Yeah, my stepmom is from there. She fled the war back in the day. I've always wanted to go. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, we're on level 33. Skill issue. What, just because I have socks? <laughs> just because I didn't lose my socks. But yeah. Yeah, it's going to be cool. It's going to be exciting and good times. Are these the ones that fuck you up because if they're on their back? I think it might be. Alright, use Gale Force. Phew. I buy my socks in bulk from Costco. Hell yeah. Yahoo! When I doubt Gale Force, yeah, when there's. I think, like, it's only gonna work for, I think, till, till we hit, like, level 50. Then I think I'm gonna be too weak to be doing this. But for now, it's it's getting us through the early. I have so many cool rocks. Not crystals, rocks. I wanna eat them. I wanna eat them. <laughs> See, that's the difference. I wanna eat the crystal star because it looks like a yummy candy. But I don't wanna eat actual rocks. <laughs> Oops. Fire! Uh, uh, okay. What if they're pop rocks? Not edible. Fuck. Yeah. yeah. Shit, 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 shit. Ah. Oh. Okay, I think we're okay. He tried to get up. Okay. Not living up to the Abaco cosplay? Wait. I'm sorry, I forgot that I have to be like every character I cosplay. I mean, yummy. Mmm, I love eating rocks. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Uh, I don't need this. I have too many items right now. Those news people are like, hi, I, hi, how does she say? Hi, I'm Daisy. That's right. Oh, shit. Okay. What? I think normal jump does six damage. Yeah. Okay, no sleepy sheep. Yeah, maybe I'll bring home a couple rocks. I don't know. I don't know if there's like rules against that though. I know some places you're not supposed to bring sand back. So maybe you're not allowed to bring rocks back from Japan. I, I should Google that. Yeah, so there's always like, there's certain things that I think is important to like look up before you go somewhere. Make sure you're not gonna like, you know, yeah. Well, I guess also there's probably certain areas where it's like, yeah, if you go to a shrine and grab a rock, it's probably not always allowed, stuff like that. I'm scared. Okay. 
Uh, maybe I'll just keep trying this and see if this works. Yeah, doing research from Heart Fan is a good idea. You don't get a ticket, you're leaving some kind of- Yeah, they might just take it away from me. Ah, oh, shit. Why are you real mad? All he did was take us down the stone and question be part of a 2,000 year old temple that probably broke apart with a hammer. <laughs> I mean, the worst part is that like, people do stuff like that. Yeah. The crystal, it's a crystal star. If you're traveling overseas, they should make a game where Mario travels the world. They could call it Papers, Please Mario. <laughs> yeah. I mean, honestly, Kate. Okay. There is, I mean, Mario Odyssey is kind of like he travels all over the world, right? Mario Galaxy travels galaxy. You'll get to be there during the summer festival month. They have Tanabats, Tanabata, and Obam festivals. Whoa, that sounds great. Mario Odyssey, but paper. Is there a fan game of that? I'm scared. I don't like these enemies. They're they're upsetting me. I don't like the way they're looking at me. Come on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Is that my hammer, Mario? I've been thinking of my cake. <laughs> Mm. There we go. Got him! Yeah! I mean, I beat the DLC last week and then finished my last video on it yesterday. I can finally enjoy things again. Uh oh! You, uh oh! Opinion on the internet! What's gonna happen? That's exciting for you though. I'm excited. Wow, I can't believe how fast you finished the DLC, but I guess the DLC's been out for a couple weeks. I don't know how long it's been. I have really bad time perception. Has it been a month maybe? It's a little slow compared to some people, but I think it was a little over two weeks. Uh, I mean, but some people also will like, like basically speed run that shit as soon as it comes out. So, uh oh, under two weeks. Okay. What color of? Of, of Koopa is it that spins on his back? I don't remember which one it is. Yeah, I was being super thorough. I did find almost everything. Oh, that's awesome. On June 21st? Wow. Wow. I need a crystal star and I kind of expect it to be sharp in my mouth. I just want that, like... I don't know. Just It, it looks like I could eat it and it would be good. All right, here's upcharge guy. Let's see what you have here, bro. Yeah, I don't need any of this. I got hot stuff, man. Hold on, I just have to run to the washroom. I'll give you like one second. Ah, uh, hello. Sorry. <laughs> How's it going? Wait, Scott Pilgrim Girl, OMG. Hello. Thanks for welcoming back. Um, I'm gonna catch up on the uh thing. Chat. Oh, here it is. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Game. Um, I was surprised by the reception in my first video. There's a lot of hate in the early time frame, but after it reached more people, a lot of people agreed with me that it was kind of disappointing in a lot of regards. Those comments got a lot of upvotes by others too. Oh, okay, cool. That's nice. That's nice when you voice an opinion and no one, well, not no one, but less people than you thought come for your throat. Um, my Frankie Foster cosplay is at 
3.4 million views. And I am perplexed by this. Um, it's, you know... Yeah, it, it is insane. It is insane. Actually, let's take a second to acknowledge that how fucking crazy that is. What? By ratio, it's 42%. Hiatus who? Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't... Uh, it's... I don't... I don't fully understand why, but I did actually look at the analytics, so... I, I kind of understand why now, because I was like, what the fuck? Okay, hopefully this works. Hold on. I'm scared. Oh, hell yeah. Wait, I don't have... Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no, I don't have Spike Stomp on! Oh, shit! Uh, oh, no! Um... All right, get coconut bombed, I guess. What? Yeah, fuck it. Actually, yeah, star power. Um... You've just been coconut mauled! Send this to a friend to coconut maul them! Yay! Okay, that was fucked up. I mean, I need to put the spike stomp on. Yee! Got coconut mauled by a bear! A. Hey. Oh yeah, but the analytics... Okay, so the reason why I was like, what the fuck? When I was looking at the analytics for... Um, actually, maybe I'll just put that on. Save myself. Because Spike Stomp is, uh, what, three? Yeah. Hammer Throw will work for now, I think. Hopefully. Back to the, um, and seeing everyone comment about the Powerpuff Girl Easter egg on her shirt. Yeah, there was lots of comments about that. Um... See, normally when a video- so, uh, the only video that I've had go that viral was uh, the Ramona Flowers when I posted like a year ago. And it has, like, so for for reference, the um, Ramona Flowers video that has similar views has 6,000, over 6,000 comments and over 600,000 likes. The Frankie video has 300,000 likes and like 700 comments. So I was like, what? Why is this gaining so much traction when the engagement isn't? as much just under 800 yeah so like it's still good like i'm not complaining i'm just like what why is this getting pushed but then i actually looked at the the deeper analytics and um the watch time for the video is really insane so people are re-watching it so that's good that's good people i guess like the dance which is funny because i've gotten some some pretty mean comments about the dance but i'm not not that many Kids being mean, unheard of. Yeah. Getting a hate comment on um a few million view video. Yeah, there's like honestly the comments are really nice for a video that's doing that well, so I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty happy about it. Um it's mostly people arguing about whether or not Frankie Foster is an imaginary friend. Um, which is really funny because the creator tweeted that Frankie is not an imaginary friend, but then people are like like, when people say, like, no, she's not an imaginary friend, people are like, let people have fun! <laughs> this is so funny. But my head cannon! Yeah. Nice. Um, actually, she is. Do you actually believe she's an imaginary friend? Because she... She has like baby pictures, her parents are mentioned. They have like flashbacks to when she was a kid. Um, there's like a lot. 
<sighs> really like your gaming YouTube videos. Never seen a style like it. Definitely lean forward to more in the future. That is so nice. A7 dog guy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, she's a cartoon. That's her imaginary checkmated. Someone actually just commented that. I saw, like, cause people, there was like a kind of longer argument and then someone was like, the whole thing's imaginary. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. It's cool. It's cool to have a video do that um, good, but it's, it's also just weird because I'm like, Cause, because it's not getting a ton of like a ton of like comments like I'm used to, I'm just like, okay, I like keep like looking and there's it's like has way more views, it has more likes, and I gain some followers, but I'm just like, I guess it's because there's no like comment interaction. I'm like, why? <laughs> you must comment. I like this video here. I like this here video, YouTube A USA money, and then I'm like, now I know why. I mean, there's uh, been not great examples of creators being retconny about specific things that didn't need th um, them. Like, are you turf ambassador? But I mean, yeah, that seems like a cut and dry example. Yeah, it's like, I think it's an interesting theory. Like, it's definitely an interesting theory. Um, but because she has like that, and he also said like, um, people can't like create imaginary friends after puberty, which is like part of why there's like the foster is home for it. So it kind of makes sense that he'd be like, no, because, like, an old person can't just, like, create, imagine a person, you know? Because I think that's part of the conflict in the show. Um, but it is a cool theory. And I think, you know, because Frankie is wearing the same outfit as Madame Foster, it does kind of create, like, a little bit of, like, why the fuck are they wearing the same outfit? <laughs> like, maybe she's not real. But sometimes you just want to match with your grandma. What can I say? You think an old person can just imagine a person? Boy, do I have someone for you to meet? <laughs> Can't just imagine a person. That's true. But they don't call that imaginary friends when you're older. They call, they call that, like, dementia. <laughs> it, it stops being cute, I guess. And it starts being like, okay, let's get you inside. Your drug abuse, yeah. I'm trying to remember what what's my FP at. I'm thinking of using an item. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Um, I'm gonna use the Koopa bun. Actually, I'll just use a simple maple, maple syrup for now. Wait, I'm about to level up. Oh! Okay, whatever, it's fine. That's exactly what I meant. You should hear my weekend stories. Oh, yeah, feel free to share. I mean, the ones that you're comfortable sharing, of course. Because right now we're in the, the part of the dungeon that's like... It's probably not a good idea. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, I am proud of that cosplay doing so well. It makes me happy. Um, yay! Uh, what foods are you most excited to try in Japan? Imagine a lot of standard options. Are sort of the off the table for your dietary taste. Um, I do eat fish, and I know that I'm probably gonna have to eat a lot more fish in Japan because they have like lot a lot less like like straight up vegetarian options. Uh, my friend who is in Japan, she's been to Japan like twice in the last year, right? So, um, she was telling me about it. So, uh, I've been I've been trying to like uh, eat more fish just so that I don't get like stomach aches from eating fish while I'm there. Um. But yeah, like definitely like sushi. Um, I mean, obviously that's a big one. And then, you know, if I can find any like ramens and stuff that doesn't have um, like beef broth, that would be pretty cool. Um, yeah, so what's your favorite kind of fish to eat? Um, 
I can be a little bit particular about which fish I will and won't eat. But... I like salmon. What else do I like? I don't remember. <laughs> and others. I like ma uh, mag Magiro and Unagi. Unagi is eel. And what is mag Magiro? Do you like fried fish? Uh... Yeah, I like I like seafood like most ways. Um When I say like what kind of fish, I mean like which like fish of like which which fish, but that's just because I I don't I try not to eat net caught fish. Um just for environmental reasons. I'm not trying to tell anyone what they can and can't do. This is not me. If you start feeling bad, that's on you. I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything but sharing my life experience. Anyway, um I try not to eat uh net caught fish because of the way that it impacts the environment. Um, but there are certain fish that can be caught net caught and there's ones that can be not caught net caught. I don't know how easy it is gonna be to to avoid it in Japan though. I don't know what their fishing habits look like there. So, um, you know, I might have to break that rule a little bit, but um, we'll see. Yeah, there's lots of different types of salmon. Um, Ah oh, shit. Okay, come here. What? Oh, I didn't know if this lady worked in here. Nice. Cheating! <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I think it's gonna be fun. I'm really looking forward to the sushi there. Um... I'm, I don't know. I haven't really thought about it that hard, to be honest. Is, am I bad for that? Like, I... <laughs> they're like, where are you going? What are you eating? Like, what are you planning? I'm like, I will be in these two places. And stuff will happen. <laughs> and hilarity ensues. Um... <laughs> So, yeah, I don't have any... Oops. Okay, 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 Goombella. Plus, konbini food is easy is easy to get by. What is... What is konbini? Convenience store. Oh! But yeah, um, I mean, those are good things to think about, but I just, I really just, like, my, I mean, my sister will probably have things planned really hardcore, because she's great, and she's awesome, and I love her. Um, Dark Pear Troopa, alright, here we go, hold on. This is a Dark Pear Troopa, it lives in dark, damp places. My HP 8 attack is 4 defenses too. It's strong, but otherwise, just like other Pear Troopas. It's air bones to try to get it on the ground first. Okay, that's it, okay. You know, she told me to do that, and then I did it, so. A good one to remember, Konbini. Yeah, I should practice a little more Japanese before I go. Um. Fuck! <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Do you have a backup plan for when you inevitably piss off a clan of ninjas? Is that a reference? <laughs> BP! I've never seen your sister. I've seen your brother and your mom. Yeah, my sister is um less online than my mom and brother, so uh will you see her? I don't know. Maybe. Onigri, ah Um 
Yeah, it's, it's, it's. What am I? No, I want that. I want this off. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, right now I don't have any like super huge plans. I just, I know that I want to wear a long skirt. It's gonna be hot. And I'm gonna buy a suitcase. And I'm gonna go outside probably. Hmm. Oh, I'll be fine with this guy. Respect that. I wish I was less online. <laughs> yeah. Hey, these movies taught me anything. Is that ninjas are a major threat, even more so in Japan. You must be a ninja to kill. <laughs> to kill a ninja bullets won't work. Maybe unless fired by a ninja for some reason. Ah, uh, yes. 80s movies. All right, we've entered new territory. I've never seen a purple bandit before. Here we go. I'm scared. I'm scared. Now the music is also, wow. Okay. Yeah, all right. All right. I like the purple. I think that looks good. I think that's a good color. It's a nice shade of purple. All right, let's see. New tunes are retro. These are the new ones. We can compare it to the, the retro after this. That's a badge. Ba what? <gasps> that's a badge bandit. He's a bandit who'll go after your badges. That jerk. I see if he's 12, attack is five and defense is zero. His high tech power and HP. He sometimes steals a badge when he tackles you. So use your guard carefully. And even if he gets one, keep your cool, okay? If he runs from the battle, you can always find him and re-engage him. Um. Yeah, 12 HP is crazy. No star points for that. That's fine. Oh, no. One star point. Okay. Yeah, strict plan kind of makes me, like, freeze, I think, a little bit. I'm like, okay, I have to do this. But I guess it kind of depends. Oh, shit. Yeah, listen to this. They added some, like, singing? Okay, let's hear what the old one sounds- I'm pretty sure it's, like, the same, kind of, but, like... It's not as jazzy. Yeah, this is it. It's very similar, but they just, they just jazzed it up a little bit, which is mostly, it's mostly what they've been doing, you know, for a lot of them, which I appreciate. I don't know, this is kind of mystical, you know, I'm liking the vibe here. Because the only problem I remember, like, having with the, the trial music is that, like, when you get to the end, that it almost starts to feel like it's so repetitive, you're like, eh. So, you know, just changing it up a little bit is nice. Um. All right, let's see if she can gale force them. It's more dungeon-esque. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of Tomb Raider in a type of way. Not in like a full way, but like, you know. Oh. Okay. Yeah, they did a really good- I was honestly expecting to kind of, like, not really vibe with the new music at all. But, like, most of the songs I've been, like, really enjoying, like, the new versions of, which is great. It is welcome.
Yeah, like I think it's it's gotten a little jazzier the deeper we get into the dungeon, which is cool. Oh fuck. What the hell is that, bro? I also need a little rest and downtime, so I'll be able to decide what to do when resting. Yeah. And I used to love those when traveling. It made me feel like we were on a school trip, like itineraries and shit. Yeah. Oh, I have tattled on these guys before. What the fuck is the audience? What the? Okay. Okay. That's fine. Um, Kim Flurry, Kim Flurry, pull it off. This might be risky, but let's see. What an explosive audience. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, terrifying. I do not like badge guys at all. They are terrifying. It scares me. Hi, second base. <laughs> Okay, okay, I don't- I don't think- wait, have I- I don't know if I've ever- mm, Tattled on one of these before. They stole your- I think they can steal your badge long term. I think they can. Oh, I have tattled on before, alright. All right, we're gonna swap and we're gonna Okay, that was that was all right. I'm just gonna do this. What? 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 I didn't see that he was holding anything. Okay, it's fine. All right, problem solved. Sneaking drugs in his ass, yeah. Do I have room for this? No. It's just a ho sound. That's what it reminds me of Tomb Raider. Ho. Oh my gosh. Wait, one second. Just look at the cat. <laughs> so precious. I don't know if I have this one tattled. I'm just going to switch to Goombella for the sake of it. Or, no. You know what? I can switch it in the game. Okay, or in the match. Okay. Is this TTYD DLC? No, this isn't the main game. It's just like a... What is it? It's like an optional challenge that you can do okay let's try gale force you passed 50 yet yes no okay that's okay that's fine But yeah, I'm pre I'm pretty sure we're uh, in level 55 or something. Um, all right, sweet. 
potentially post game challenge. Yeah, it's. I mean, usually people do a post game, but you don't have to. What a tune. We know you're coping. It's okay, Poppy. How many levels are there? It's a hundred. It's the pit of a hundred trials. Yeah, we're on level 56. I'm 38. All right. Um. Oh my god, these guys are fucking terrifying. Uh. Alright, come on. You can do it. Flurry, I believe. This is the most use you're getting in this whole game. It is your- Oh no! Okay, okay, there's only one left. Okay, we can take care of this. That's fine. He has six health. I, I have enough to- <laughs> Okay. Another 55 guests. Thank you. I'm mildly paying attention. Sometimes. Oh. <laughs> uh. Keep it coming. <laughs> Hi, crazy bald man. How's it going? Okay, yeah, that guy can't. He's too cool for me. Um, piercing blow might do the job by itself. It did. Gaming. How goes it today? Good, how are you? Yeah, ADHD, what? What's that? Uh, I wouldn't know. I like that you can use something. Because when you toss something, then quickly try to use something, and it's like this like very scary moment. Very tired, just off work. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope uh, I hope you wake up and enjoy your, your day, despite it having been working. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm gonna seek some boots. Some boots? Like in real life you're trying to buy some boots or? What? Why do they all have dizzy dolls suddenly? I don't know what HD is, but the doctor says I have 80 of them. <laughs> uh, I want combat boots and maybe also spocking? I think that's what they're called. What is what is that? Love some boots can't afford right now. You can do it one of these days. I need to try them in person because I don't know what my woman's shoe size is. Ah, valid. It's a knee-high style. Oh, that's cool. Hell yeah. Okay. So these enemies seem to be susceptible to the gale. You should play Ocarina of Time on stream if you haven't. I have, but it's been a minute since we have. It's been, it's been, it's actually, it's been a few years since we played Ocarina of Time, hasn't it? That's, that's a little too long, you're right. I love Ocarina of Time, it's a great game. Master mode? Potentially. Uh, 
Ocarina's Mr. Mouse's Fave. It's such a good one. Knee high Chucks, you have some? No. What is Chucks? Are you f If I put two double dip badges on, does that- Do I get to f quadruple dip? Wearing two of these allows Mario to use up to three items, but it also increases required FP. Okay, cool. That tells me. Converse? Oh, no. I've never owned a pair of, like, Converse brand, con like, like high tops. Um, Chuck Taylor is another term. Oh, okay. I've heard of that. I've, I've heard that phrase before, but that makes sense. What? Why does that enemy casually have 20 health? Okay. I, um... Dark Lakitu. Okay. That's a Dark Lakitu. It rides a rain cloud. My HP is 13, attack is 5, defense is 0. It attacks by throwing spiny eggs at you. If it's holding up a spiny egg when you jump on it, you'll get hurt. And sometimes the spiny eggs it throws turn into sky blue spinies. Whoa! If you only attack the spinies, you'll never win. So go after the Dark Lakitu. Okay. I dip back. Woo! Okay, so in order to minimize damage dealt, we need to go for the weaker enemies first. So, um. All right, Flurry, hit him with the Gale Force. Let's see if this works. Shit. What? <laughs> Why did it work on all three of them? Huh? Okay. Look God's blessing Flurry Day, for real, what? <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I thought maybe it would work on one of the Lakitus. I was, that was just a, like a... Just a, a, an attempt. Okay, I think these might be the little shits. The shit bones. I was playing Paper Mario 64 earlier today and I forgot about the super guards. Yeah. Yup. No super guards in Paper Mario 64. You just gotta raw dog that. That's a dry bones. It's a former Koopa whose spirit animates its bones. Eek, that's so freaky. My HP is eight, attack is five, and defense is two. When its HP goes down to zero, it'll collapse into a pile, but it'll eventually rise again. Fire and explosions will put a permanent end to getting it back up though. A dry bones will sometimes build friends if it feels it's outnumbered. If you don't take them all out close together, they'll just keep coming back. Let's wipe them out all at once and quick. These things totally freak me out. <laughs> and I would not fuck them. 36 months. Time is crazy. You all fucking rock. Thank you so much, Convals. Time is crazy. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Um, what, do, what the, what the flip? What the flip? Um, I kind of want to Gale Force again, but I used Goombella, so... What happens if I do this? Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so is it what a PFD down badge or what's that? Let's just see if this works. I don't know. I, my thought is like, if it worked once, it could work again. Nope. All right. D up, P down. Okay. Me when the P up is up and the D is down. Ooh, bingo! P R N G O. Yes. <laughs> Full FP. Let's go. Okay, when is Dry Bones gonna wake up? Let's use a Fire Flower. There we go. Okay, so I, I, I should have my spike guard on. Okay, I do. <laughs> For a second, I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> I feel like this is starting to get really hard. Yeah, having a, a 20 HP enemy just casually chilling there. This is, uh, this is where, yeah, this is where it starts to get tricky. The dry bones are also real, real shitters, that's for sure, so. Okay, we're on level 60 tier, so we still have 40 to go. Did you see the trailer for the new season of Futurama? It starts later this month. Looks pretty good. Ooh, I liked the new season of Futurama that came out last year. Oh, it's this dude. I hate these guys. Okay, it's been a long time since I fought one of these. Um, oh crap. I don't remember what the wizard does. I just remember that they're like really annoying and dry bones next to them is not a good, this is not a good combo. Let's read what this says. That's a dark wizard. It's a part machine, part organic centuries old thing. Max HP is 10 attack is five defenses too. It uses magic to attack to alter your condition. So stay on guard. If there's only one left, it'll multiply itself to confuse you. I know they look totally goofy, but they're actually pretty tough enemies. And I would not fuck him. Okay. Well, let's just, um, let's just off the cuff try to... Onk! Wait, what? Wait, I didn't notice that their defense was really high. Ha ha ha. Oh, no. Okay. That was not very pog. Um... Um. Could I be wasting a turn? Maybe. All right. Goodbye, wizard. I mean, I could have done that anyway if she attacked, but whatever. Um, we need to. We need to. this <laughs> look at those hands i would fuck the wizard okay good oh whatever okay okay um They don't call him the wizard for nothing. Okay, let's see if I can actually land this. I was I was so looking forward to that. Okay. Burning punch that sets enemies on fire. All right, give me hit him with the punch. Oh, 
How long do I have before the other dry bones reanimate? Oh. Okay. Bummer. That was not good for me. We win! Oh, we got a lot of star points for that. Good, because um, my health suffered uh, some. Yeah, we're only in the 60s and we're getting some fat star points, which is not a great sign. But it's fine. Okay, I think we might be at the point where we can't use Flurry anymore. I mean, at level 70, it has to be certain, but... Yeah, level up means more heals, it's true. to even be doing this, but... Oh, God! Okay. It truly was. It truly was, but... Um... If these guys attack me, I think I'm cooked, actually. So, let's just art attack. Blue raspberry? They do kind of look like blue raspberry piranhas. I accept this. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ah! Okay, we got it. And we got enough to grief. Okay. <sighs> Alright, I think it's time we swap buddies. I have to give up on the, on the gale force. Okay, so... Wait, I was gonna read her, her description there. Oh my god. Hides in the shadows, attack all foes with flames, blow a kiss to enemies to confuse them. Da damage enemies that attack Bobbery. Bombo cast is crazy, but it, it could be good. Um. All right, let's just, just, just have her with us for now. I don't know. I'm scared. Are all your sidekicks mass now? Yeah, I got all the. I got them all leveled. They're all fully leveled. Okay, so there's this guy here. Okay, but Gale Force worked on these guys one time, so now I'm like, do I do it? But no, no, I'm not doing it this time. Um. Have to do this, but wait, I should have focused on the Lakitu because he's gonna have a child. Don't do what is that? Goombella, you did not warn me that he could do that. Goombella, that's fine. Okay, you just gotta hit him with the shade fist. All right, we did it, we did it. <sighs> Only five star points for that? <laughs> ah! What do you mean? I mean, I guess we barely got hurt. 
but still it was scary. But it was scary. Hi, Goddamn Superman. How you doing? Maybe this guy would be good for this. I don't know. Bonk! The pregnant mother. Oh no! Get the wizard out of here! Okay. Um. Okay, we're going for the Lakitu here just because he will reproduce. Uh, the wizard will try to confuse us. So... I'm not sure if Ground Pound will work on this guy. Alright, so he should probably try to confuse us. Yeah. So... Fuck it. Oh well, whatever, at least I know which one it is. Oh yeah, I forgot the defense is really high. Don't do it again! I don't know, let's see, maybe it's the first one. Okay, I have a feeling it's actually this one this time. That was a joke. Yeah, it's... Did I get you? Okay. Charm really helped me. Instead of it being 39 to 37 C's, or more than like 26, 28. Oh, that sounds good. Okay, that was um scary. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, I, ooh. Okay, that's gonna be fine. We're gonna get these guys so good, and it's gonna be fine. How much damage does Shade Fist even do? Only one way to find out. Unless I do this all. Uh, no, I'll just do this. Ah. Wait, you know what? It'll take him out in the next round. Okay. Yeah. Alright, now the fire should burn him. What? What the hell? Okay, fine, whatever. It was 49.4 degrees Celsius at your parents yesterday? Oh my god, I'm amazed that you're alive. You survived. Okay, scary, but we're okay. Hurricane down south is gone. It'll be oh, what the hell? Not a hurricane. Whee! Okay, we have a lot of money though. So if we see that guy, 
That will be good. Is Big Cooler at the airport or they would have had to ground the plane? <laughs> You're grounded! Okay. That was a great joke. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Still 37. Whoa, that's so hot. Not the guy with the. Okay, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to try to steal that from him. Otherwise, oh, that's a lot. Of, that's a lot of HP. Uh, okay. Is that? Is that? Even, um. Okay. I think. I think. Okay, first of all, we're gonna do this. Yay, okay. And then, I'm gonna swap to Ms. Mouse, and we're gonna kiss Thief him. Wait, do I have room in my items? If I do that, she won't actually take the item if I, as, if I don't have room in my items. But I just used an item, right? I think I have room in my items. Okay. Yeah, buddy! Okay. Oh, Miss Mouse! What? Okay. Okay, that's good. I feel better now. Um, so I can't hit him with my hammer. Uh, 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 okay, wait, I have an idea. No, yes, no, wait. Okay, I have maybe, I don't know. Okay, and then, okay, and then we're gonna, we're gonna swap to rot, okay? And then he's gonna use gulp. Oh no! <laughs> uh! Okay, that was what I was gonna do, but that's, it's fine. so epically pranked epic epic prank uh. J station 2.0 that's me Bruh. Okay, we're not doing too bad realistically. It would have been really nice to get that bonus, but we're pretty close to leveling up in just a couple more battles until we level, so I think I'll manage. What are we at? Level 60. Oh, hell yeah! Level We go level 69. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is um, attack all foes of flames and set them on fire. All right, this should hurt them. Y B A B B. Epic. Um, 
I don't like that they all have four health left. Quake Hammer typically does two. Uh, maybe this will do good. I don't know. Okay, it did kind of good. They'll get to attack me, but then afterwards they'll, they'll, they'll pass away. So... Oh, shit. Yeah, the mist has been generous. Okay, cool. Okay, so, like, two more battles. We hit a little low on FP, though. Might not be about. Oh, we'll see how many FP we pick up here. I have not burned a life shroom yet, but who knows. Because there, there, don't forget, at the end of this, there is a, a little boss battle, so. Um... 7 HP, 5 HP, 15 FP, blah, blah, blah. HP, 15 FP. Hmm. Oh my gosh, Ashley! What the heck? Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, Raiders. Hi! How was Elden Ring? Um, if you don't know me, I'm Rotten Poppy. I'm a retro variety streamer. We're playing Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door right now. I am in the pit of 100 trials. I haven't beaten the game yet. Um, I have beat the game, like, the old version of the game when I was, like, younger. But it's one of my favorite games of all time. So. Oh, wait. We're about to lo enter level 70. We did a wild boss rush from the DLC, so we only have the final boss left. Whoa, that's awesome! Oh, my Dai Thank you for giving that stuff to Ashley. That's so nice of you. Double dip P. That's so sweet. Oh, that's awesome. Um, if you have to go like pee and eat and stuff, feel free to go do that. Uh, but I hope you had a super good time. Thank you so much for bringing everyone, ev everyone over here. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm in level seventy of the pit of hundred trials. So at the hundred mark is the you know the special thing. It's getting a little dicey here. Um, just a little dicey. Okay, so the uh, the difficulty is about to ramp up. So, using a little maple syrup might not be a bad idea. Well, I could use it in battle, maybe. I don't know. I'm scared. Level 70, I have to do the pit, but I'm scared. Yeah, it's definitely scary. I haven't, um, like, a lot of people wait till, like, after you beat the game to do the pit, but I'm doing it pre, pre final dungeon. Oh, no. Okay. Hey, these dudes you got this thank you thank you yeah so this is kind of like if Elden Ring was a cartoon and um, a Nintendo game and 2d and okay okay what okay um, okay Yeah, if I can do it before we beat the game, we have a bounty on it. Oh, uh, okay. That's a wizard. It's a part machine, part organic centuries old thing. Max HP is 10, attack is 6, and defense is 3. It uses magic to he attack, heal, and alter your condition, so stay on guard. Its defense is high, but we can totally take this thing. Okay. 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 I could use Sweet Feast, or I could use Art Attack. <laughs> Your Goombella voice is so good. Oh, thank you. I like to do a little voice acting from time to time to time to time. Okay, no more wizards. Woo! Okay, super guarded. Okay, okay. <sighs> How much does gulp cost? It's four, right? So it's three right now, so I can't afford it. Um, I 
Maybe Bobbery? I don't know. Alright, let's see if this does good. <laughs> I thought it was mash! I thought you had to mash it. What? Okay, we can still afford this. Okay, yep, yeah, free turn, woo, no problem. Okay, now we level, so I didn't need to use an FP item. <laughs> Wait, do we, or are we one short? I think we're one shy. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, that's fine, that's fine. We picked up four FP. Ah, thank you, thank you. Welcome in, Spike Super Kirby. Okay. Nice troll me, Mono. Oh. Okay. Okay, we got this. Okay, let's see. Can we do art attack again? We can. Two of those guys? Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Whew. Okay, so let's get rid of... All right, wizard is done. Okay. Let's do this. Fuck. Okay. Super guarded. Yay. Okay. 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 He can take care of him. And then. Okay. It doesn't matter if I get this bingo anyway because even if I do I'm leveling next this this after this battle 100% okay all right ah! okay we're chilling we're chilling it doesn't even matter it doesn't matter because we're about to level Yeah, I love Art Attack. It was always my favorite when I was a kid. All right, here we go. Woohoo! Okay. So we have... So I can increase my FP or... I think I'm going to increase my HP. Some of these enemies are getting a little close to uh, the, with the amount of damage that they can do. And I haven't leveled up my HP in a minute, so... We're gonna go ahead and go HP. Or it takes longer to circle them all, or you can pick to do a single target. Yeah, it's cool. Art attack is so good. All right, bam. And then we full everything. Okay. We're going. Do you have some defense badges? I do, actually, yeah. Actually, yeah, let's reconsider my badges now that we're in um, new territory here. Quick change has been very helpful. Spike shield has been good. Flower founder is good. Um, I don't know how much happy heart and everything is helping us here, but let's see. Cause yeah, we've defend plus. We have defend plus P. They're five each though. Um, power plus, double dip, quake hammer, piercing blow. Mm. Yeah, I could take off my happy hearts, but I'm feeling okay about them right now. Or, actually, I guess I won't need them if I'm not taking as much damage. Let's see. I can't even afford defense 
I can uh, I can increase. Do damage dodge though. All right. We're on level seventy two. Yeah. Okay, we got a green flame here. So Bobbery is a bad enemy. Yeah, I think like, just like sometimes like you'll get a bunch of enemies that all do like eight attack, right? So if you just happen to get hit a whole bunch, I don't know, eight attack each, I'm still cooked if there's five enemies, but you know. All right, what the hell is this? That's a phantom ember. It's an angry spirit born of hatred and confusion. So, um, I'm not too cool with this thing. Black. Nice to be 10 attack is 5, defense is 0. It'll take damage if you touch it, and something even worse will happen if you attack it with fire. So, if it attacks you, you might catch on fire, so try to guard well. Let's send this ghoul back to the grave, okay? B please. Uh, what did you just say to me, you little bitch? Okay. What happens if you attack it with fire? It heals. Okay, that was stupid what I just did. All right, whatever. Um, I mean, it's not like they get powered up or something. Uh, I mean, I guess they could. Mm. I'm not feeling very cash money, but all right, whatever. I, I'll I'll just okay. Free defense for me, but not for Coops. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, you know what I can do? All right. Let's see, maybe I'll land on the star after this. Because we have a bonus set up. I forgot that I was gonna try to get the whatever, it doesn't matter. Ooh. Anyway, we got power punch. Power punch! Okay, Coops is a little low on health, but we're okay, we're okay, we're fine, everything's fine. <sighs> It's Sir Swoop. Um, also, thanks for the follows, everyone from Ashley's stream. I have my follow alerts turned off, so they're just anonymous right now, but I really appreciate it. I don't, um, what's my, um, M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M I think people like that better, really. Yeah, I think for the most part, you know, if you, if you want to get your name specifically called out, first time chatting is a good way of doing that, but I prefer it personally. Like, usually when I'm lurking, like, I get a little nervous if there's follow alerts. Um, okay, this is fucked up. Okay. That's a swoopala, an airborne, blood-sucking, bat-like thing. Nice HP is 9, attack is 4, defense is 0. As if it's losing HP wasn't bad enough, this creep adds yours to its own. How totally, totally gross! Don't let it bite me, Mario! And I would not fu- <laughs> Um... Okay, I don't want them to use the dizzy dial. But how are they going to use the dizzy dial if I art it? <laughs> yeah, her loss. 
she doesn't want her blood sucked. Okay, that was pretty good. Okay. 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 Um, all right. Is Goomba a valley girl? Sure. She could be. Uh, okay, we're gonna swap to Rot here. And we're gonna gulp him. And I'm actually gonna do it. See? Bam! Okay. The OG came up before. Twilight explains a lot. B I N G. Oh, I mean, I, I have a lot of FP. I, I, <laughs> five FP, yay! Ah, uh, I totally hit that on time. Oh well. Wait. No, wait, no, that's good. Okay. But yeah, knowing the stylish moves that helps fill up your star bar faster, so that has been helpful in this dungeon. She should be canonically only listed interested in sailors. <laughs> Let's write to Miyamoto. I mean she kind of is. So far, those are the only ones that she talks about. Like, they're actually good looking. Aside from Mario, I guess. So, I guess Plumber falls under that. But everyone in this in this game is attracted to Mario for some reason. It's, it's He's just, like, the hottest guy in town. Or something. Okay, Chompy. The Rizzler. Yeah, he's the Rizzler. I don't like seeing the wizard. All right, just tattle on him. Let's see. That's a chain chomp. I'd hate to get chomped by those teeth. They look nasty. My HP is seven, attack is six, and defense is five. Its body is hard, so most attacks won't do much. Plus, you can't damage it with fire or ice attacks. Luckily, it has low HP, so you can take it down with a special move or an item. Chain Chomps are, like, so super pumped all the time. Don't they ever get tired? You know, she's asking the right questions. Okay. Yeah. I forgot they have really high defense. Okay. Okay, I tried to super guard that and it didn't work. Ah! Oh. Go Goombella. Yeah. Okay. Um. <laughs> yeah, can't relate. Imagine having energy. Couldn't be me. Okay, so we have Mr. there with his one. So what happens if I like Ultra Hammer? Okay, that worked pretty good. I mean, the wizard still has one health, which is bad. Because that means he's probably gonna multiply and that's annoying. Okay, or he's gonna up his defense for some reason. Okay. Do whatever you want, bro. That was a silly move. <laughs> Energy what? Phew, okay, okay. I've lost all my energy to the study of the martial art honk shoe. <laughs> Real. Energy after your early 20s? <laughs> Imagine that. Okay, we have another wizard. Um, yeah, actually, we'll keep Rot with us. <clears throat> OK, 
Okay. Oh, hold on. I have an idea. I have an idea that isn't using art attack. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, never mind, I guess. That was weird, but all right. I guess I did it too late, maybe? Ah. Not the, okay. I guess the wizard's staying alive for now. Can we see the fit? No. This is what you'll get for now. Okay, okay. What? Oh shit. Whew, okay. All right, this better hit. All right. Idea that doesn't include Artek? Not interested, not interested. Yeah, I don't know. This might not have been the... Okay, never mind. Okay, I think, honestly, eh, that, that, you know, it wasn't so bad. It wasn't so bad. At least you did not get the poison shroom. I don't even know what happens when you get the poison shroom. I'm sure I've landed on it before, but I, I, I don't remember what it does. something hmm I thought I had something is this cookie oh yeah this so we have I don't know four fights with uh, okay okay hold on we'll wait to use that item <laughs> could you imagine if Bob Ross unlocked Art Attack? The world would be helpless. The world could do nothing to stop him. You know what? Since we're leveling up soon, let's use Art Attack. Yippee! Oh fuck. I started trying to read chat at the same time that I did that. Ah! Okay. Oh fuck, okay. Oh wait, oh what? Oh no! Ah! Oh, the items! All right, whatever. Look at this dynamic duo, yeah. <laughs> Popping up, bam! Thank you, second base. Um, so that's not gonna work on him. So I guess I'll just appeal. If all three poison mushrooms get raised in Bingo Machine, both Mario and his partner's hit points will get cut in half, both flower and star points are halved, and all except for one of the audience will leave. That's the worst news. I'm glad we didn't land on that. That would have sucked. You know, you may be transparent, but you can still get super guarded. And that's what's the truth. I can't remember how normal hammer works on these guys. I'm just going to try it. Okay, that worked. That's pretty bad, actually. Worse than I thought. Yeah, that was pretty horrible.
I think in my replay, poison mushroom was the first bingo I got. Rip. That's rough. Oh yeah, don't forget tomorrow is very special stream. I will be cosplaying as Shrek and then cooking Shrek food. So if you are a person who likes things, there is no reason not to come to stream tomorrow. Starting at sometime around 11 a.m. Central. So close to leveling up. Oh my gosh. Not again. 98. <laughs> Hi, King Bolt. Cooking Shrek food? Exactly. That's the, that's the kind of reaction that I'm looking for. Are we cooking poison mushrooms? That'd be tough. Um, yes. Revealing my secrets. Okay, come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, okay, sorry. Oh, sorry, Rot. <sighs> this is so sad. I don't have enough for art attack. What kind of existence is this? All right, um, we're just gonna... And then the nice thing about this is that I can actually gulp these guys in the back here. Aw, oh, man. What? Oh, I hate these guys. Whoa! Okay, that's fine. We're leveling up after this. It's fine. Everything's fine. I didn't die. What, you didn't believe in me? BP! I did, I was just pranking you back. It's all fun and games until someone rolls up with Paper Yoshi by mistake. <laughs> okay. Uh, sounds fun. Uh, some restaurant in Minneapolis is doing an event this weekend where they serve a seven course meal themed around Shrek while they watch the movie. What? That sounds awesome. How, how come they copied my style? Bump attack enables you to defeat weak foes by bumping into them on the field. Oh, that's nice. Oh, okay, here we go. We're entering the 80s. Okay, we have badges now. We have double dip P. We have power jump, multi bounce, strength, soft stomp, tornado. Um, okay, we're gonna increase our. damage. Mm. What else do we have equipped that I could maybe remove? Mm. Mm. <laughs> After watching you all these years, there is nothing I don't think you can do with games like this. It's not something I would question anymore. I learned my lesson after Mario RPG. Thank you. <laughs> um, okay, maybe... Maybe... Uh... Ah! 
Okay. I'm just, I'm gonna, um, and then I'm gonna, um, hmm. Um, okay, so I have four left. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to think of what to do here. Uh, like half of these won't do anything. Um, fire drive might be a good one to put on, actually. No. At the state, maybe. And then we'll pop on. Pop on. Timing shooter again, because I like it. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> <laughs> OK. 